in this scenario, uh, I have made and I'm on, on my way to I have, I have an event coming up and I have ordered some swag that I want to distribute at that event and I haven't received that yet. So I'm going to use this chatbot to check on the status of my, of my order and, and we'll take it from there. So in this case, I just text the chatbot and let it know that I have a delayed shipment. The chatbot comes back to me asking me for the email address that the receipt for this particular procurement was sent to. Now, once I give it this information that requires, the, uh, we have all the information that we need in order to kick off the process um, <clears throat> in UiPath. So what you should begin to see on the right-hand side very shortly is a unattended robot that goes into SAP, looks up all of the orders um, for this customer, and identifies the order that I am talking about. Again, all of this is possible without writing a single line of code to make this sort of integration happen. So here we see the robot has gone into SAP, it's found the order that I'm talking about, and it should come back to me with the status. Right, so while we wait on that, there are a couple of important things to call out here. Oh, there we go. So we see that the, the chatbots come back and let me know that my order 10580 hasn't been shipped because they're out of stock of this particular item. Note that the robot was able to get that order number from SAP and send that back to the end user as confirmation in the chat. Now, the, the, since this particular item is out of stock, I have a few substitution options. In this case, uh, since I need to provide some sort of swag for the event, I'm going to say that, uh, can I get, I'm going to ask for the waterproof wireless speakers instead. And since this is swag, I want maybe, let's say, I want to give out five of these for people who are super uh, participating uh, in, in the particular session that I'm holding. Now again, we see that the robot had, that we've identified enough information from this chat. We're triggering yet another unattended robot to go into SAP and create this new order on behalf of the end user. And finally, once the order is created, just as before, we're going to take the new order number and send that back to the end user via chat. So what we just saw was an end user, myself, was able to have a conversation with a chatbot about a delayed shipment. Once I gave it enough information uh, that, uh, that it needed to be able to do the lookup, in this case, my email address, it kicked off an unattended robot that went into SAP, looked up my orders, found the order I was talking about, and came back to me with its latest status. I was then able to order a substitution using this chatbot, and again, once it had the information it needed, such as the, the substitution I wanted and the amount of the quantity, it was, going, it was able to, again, cre uh, trigger an unattended process to run and create this new sales order in SAP and get back to me with the new sales order ID. All of this was possible without having to have a human involved, completely automated by combining chatbots with UiPath robots. Okay.